Hey there, so in this tutorial I'm going to explain you how you can write a weekly test report. Uh, I'm not following any IEEE or BCS standard here for this project. Uh, so uh, you can take any sample testing project and then try to file a weekly status template. Let's say we have a project for Android app testing and I'm supposed to give weekly status on the testing of that app. So what goes inside my report is these fields. Uh, in green you'll find that these are basically the formal information regarding who prepared this template or say sorry a document then name of the project date and status so this should go in green just for the sake of understanding the project details then the active defects closed defects and test execution these three fields are for what you have worked on so if the number of defects are 30 and you closed around 12 or so and how many test cases you have executed for this 30 defects should be in these columns now we are going back again with our weekly total task report with this orange color table here you have to write the project task then issue description then the possible solution that you think should be for the task then issue resolution date so you have to fill up this temp table and keep track of the your weekly accomplishments now two more uh, column we have to fill for is for next week like say pending deliverables and new tasks so what are some of the de deliverables you have like uh, let's say you have user interface for the app it's pending and the task for the same so this should go side by side then there is a sheet number two where you have project accomplishment accomplishment date so in your project what you have accomplished so far and the date of that accomplishment so that is pretty much our test report you can even extend it uh, with more management input depending on your project but this much status report should be enough if you are a fresher or a newcomer in testing work i hope you find this template useful and i will see you in the next tutorial